Okay. I made a big mistake yesterday. I pulled this swather off the end of the trailer and I turned too quick and that darn tire went over and clipped the end of the ramp and poked a hole in the sidewall of my tire. So <clears throat> lessons learned to make sure I get clear away from the ramps at the end of the ramps. So it delayed me for a day. I went to town to get a new tire and nobody had one in town and so they had to order one. So I'm a day behind on this project. But hopefully I'll get it up and running this afternoon and get a bunch more hay cut. Okay, made it home. I've got two of the fields cut that I needed to get cut. Well, three of them now. I've the first one I got cut and bailed, and I got to come back. I was originally gonna just do part of that one, but the person that owns it asked if I would do some more. So that one's kind of on the back burner until I get this other all of this other place done. Anyway, I did two small fields after the big one I originally started in and got the swather back home and darn the luck. <laughs> this brand spanking new tire, the original tire on it was in really good shape that I cut on that loading ramp and 
went and got another brand spanking new tire and when I got it home the tire was flat and look at this stick stuck in it and it goes all the way in because the tire was flat anyway I am hoping I'm gonna run it to town this morning and I'm hoping that they'll patch it I know that tire shops usually won't do a patch on the sidewall but hopefully I can get them to patch it because you know it's not a highway tire I drive it like three miles an hour I can't imagine why you couldn't patch it and get away with it so I'm gonna go see if I can rather than replace this brand new tire but anyway that's where we're at still got a lot more hay to get cut and belled and put up and thanks for watching